my first week of pickup was last week. I played two times, so I'm trying to get back into the thick of things. Um, we're talented. I mean, we got a lot of weapons. Um, I'm excited about the start of the season. I can't wait to get things going tomorrow. I can have the ball. I cannot have the ball. Um, it doesn't really matter with me. I can play any way. I like to. I make adjustments um, whether who I'm out there on the floor with, and um, I think that's the plus of this. All I could. We don't all have to have the ball. We don't. We can play off the ball. We can have the ball, and, and things like that. Vice versa. As you've been playing with your teammates and as you're wearing a Suns jersey today, have you felt like all right, the decision I made was the right one? Everything's just confirming that. You can say that. I mean, you never know until the games really start. And you never know if you made the right decision to, to what happens in the season. I mean, it could all be funny games in the off season, but I mean, you gotta you gotta put it all out there on the floor once the real games come. So once the season starts, I think I could I could get a feel of okay if I made the right decision or not. Hopefully I did. Um I feel like I have. I, I put it in God's hands and, and and I go from there. I do what I can control, and that's going out there giving it my all. Um, people ask me that all the time. It's just something I've always done my whole life. Like I've always been short, so I've always had to figure a way out how to finish around the rim. So it, it's kind of it comes easy to me. I mean, it's not easy, but I, I maneuver myself. I make adjustments in the air, and I just try to use my height to my advantage when I'm when I'm down there. When you first signed with the Celtics, you said they wanted to bring your door back. Um, cause, I mean, you you can be worried. I mean, just because you never know what's gonna happen. I mean, you never really seen three talented guards like us on the same team. Um, so that's coach's problem. I mean, he has to play us. Um, he has to figure out how he's gonna play us. But at the same time, I, I am excited. I'm excited for a new chapter in my life. Um, I love competition. I love competing. I think at the end of the day, that's what it's going to be about, making each other better and making this team take the next step, which is the playoffs. And um, any way I can possibly help, I'm going I'm to do that, and I'm going to do what they brought me in here for, and that's just to be me. And that's all I know. And um, hopefully that translates to more wins and us getting into the playoffs. You mentioned how this team has a lot of weapons. Any of the guys that you haven't played with before, have they just kind of caught you off guard like, wow, this guy's really good? Um, I still can't tell the twins apart, so I don't know which one <laughs> is which. But the twins are, they're, they're talented. They're talented. And then Anthony Tolliver, he can shoot the ball so well. I didn't know he could shoot as well as he can. And just everybody. I mean, because I've been in a different situation the last three years, and I only played the Phoenix Suns four times, so I didn't really focus in on them. Gerald Green's very talented, one of the most talented shooting guards in the NBA. And, um, we got a talented group of guys that, 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 that work hard, and, and I can't wait to get things started. I mean, be, me playing, I've only played twice with these guys since I've been here the last three weeks due to my, my wrist injury, but um, everybody's communicating, everybody's kind of on the same page and just willing to learn, and that's, that's half the battle right there, when everybody just wants to learn and, and, have, and has open ears and, and, and things like that, I think that, that takes away a lot of things. Um, we did have a talented group of guys in Sacramento. It just didn't click for whatever reason. But I think even playing against these guys four times a year, seeing that there's really no arguments on the floor, these guys love playing with each other. Um, I always say these guys play for each other, not just with each other. And when you got a team that plays for each other, they'll run through a wall for you. And um, I think this team is the definition of that. And I, like I said, I just want to do anything possible to help this team take take it to the next level, which is the playoffs. And, and hopefully, I can do that. Anything else? Do you have a brother that the Suns could sign? Man, there's a brother out there somewhere. <laughs> I, I, I'm gonna find him if if, if I do. Because they're signing all the relatives. Maybe I could get a cousin or something out here. <laughs>